How's it going, beautiful people? Let's get into the seasonal server. By this time, you probably have so much information, you probably can update me in the comment section below. So if I mess up any information that I provide in this video, you can go ahead and down below, fix me right up. I managed to get to a level 55 with my Karina, AKA I'm about, and uh, so far I'm very happy with the belt. Why is everybody's Karanda? 16 minutes, I guess I, I'll, I'll chill. So uh, I begin the stream with um, basically just getting right into it. And uh, I leveled up to a level 10, bought the seasonal pass. As you can see, I still haven't reclaimed this. Yeah, I will claim all of these when I actually complete all of these because I kind of want to, you know, have everything and then, you know, bam. Then I got the classical outfit and then start the real adventure, basically complete the one of the quests and boom, extra couple of slots in the inventory, reach level two, easy enough. Trouble at the Dalphine Castle, but this is pretty much like the Quran, the basically the pigeons at the at the ridge right here and uh, do that then uh, reach level 40 then let's go to catfish man then reach level 50 then go and complete the medaya start or uh, wrap up medaya by doing this or start up medaya sorry and um defeat 300 bashims that did that 500 uh, gahas did that as well equipped a tuvala uh, ring easy enough and this is i think this is the um, the hardest part or this is why I still haven't done it. It's basically um, a Valencia one uh, ending or near the end quest, which I'm gonna do now in front of you. So when you go into Valencia, this is the Eden descent, which is what you need to do for uh, to finish up this whole thing. Because later on, you just need to kill a thousand fetus, which is pretty simple. And you know, just, you just kill a thousand of them, and you're good then reach level 60 that's probably i'm gonna ask my guildies maybe they can boost me up in in a tree group maybe there's already people are you know grinding there maybe it's something so i'm gonna or use the pillar face scroll so i assume i need to use it i can't be in the party with someone that uses it uh then kill zarka and then karanda also a question that pops up or uh, popped up in in the channel or in the chat while i was streaming was can you do them in separately um the answer is yes but you cannot accept them so let's say if i now would kill uh karanda i couldn't accept this i would need to still do them one by one but it does like activate uh enhancing ring i have 71 percent and i think at tet or uh you're if you're when you're trying to get a tet i think the chance is like 30 percent. so even like the stacks work so let's say if you use a stack, Valx cries, boom. So as you can see, the stack rose. So the stones that you use is the Tuvala Ore. The Tuvala Ore, you exchange them at the pretty much blacksmith uh, or near the blacksmith, if I remember correctly. You just click the NPC and it's gonna take you to the closest one. Uh, then you refine to try duo or try gear. And uh, these things enhanced with or you use for the things that it says in the list down below. So what is up with the seasonal servers? Like what is the point of them? For me, it was mainly just for the fun, actually a new player's perspective on BDO. And if you're a new player, seasonal server, like if you never touched BDO before, this like seasonal server would be like the best way to join in. And it's like easy mode so far. It's uh, giving you goals so you're not like lost around the world. You can still do live skilling, you can still participate with other people in like normal servers. But you got the gear, you enhancing is much easier with the with these stones. People are flooded everywhere and it's actually to do fun, it's like fun to do group content. Like mobs are contested, everybody's like talking with each other, I guess we're not talking to each other. No, no. It's just a really fun experience from my perspective. Yeah, we need to finish it so I can be done finally with this. Literally for 14 hours, I've been doing quests. The one thing that I do not like to do in the game. Will I enhance more? Probably not. I'm gonna probably chill. I don't really need the, the gear from the server. Uh, the only thing that I'm gonna probably do here is collect all the, the things in this video. Obviously all the boxes. Oh, uh, another question that popped up during the stream is, um, is the battle spirit pass worth it? I don't know. Like you got a classical, you get a couple of inventory slots, seven day camo, a pet doggy, some more inventory slots, a book, 
couple of stacks, 50 mil extra, a couple of uh, butler and uh, another storage, a couple enhancing materials, artisans, some loot scrolls, crowns, valk, a couple more stacks, crowns, stacks, stacks. Is that worth it? $22. There it is. If the character completes a certain challenges during the season, once the season ends, they can choose either Penkaposha Earring or Penkaposha Ring. I would recommend choosing uh, the Kaposha ring because you get 17 AP and uh, that is a pretty much a Tet good accessory like a Tet Crescent or a Eye of the Ruin ring but Ruin ring obviously has the HP and the Pen Kaposha earring is like a Tet Narc. A Tet Narc is way cheaper to get from the market than a Tet Crescent ring or I have the Ruin ring. Boom and we done did it. Season day two. I think I just, this is just the daily that you yoink yourself. People have been panicking during stream. You, you know what? You can inform me because you can be concise and precise. Can, can I take these? Because people panic when I press these. So I don't want to even touch that dude because people panic too much. So um, also regarding tier nines, you can use tier nines because uh, I don't know what I, why did they decide to not have tier nines. They just don't like fun, I guess. So I have to use a tier eight Tavala Ore, and you look for the NPC, which is now in this situation it is the dude, and you exchange for the gear that you want. As we just got some stones, I can actually continue on enhancing, which I wanted to enhance the helmet because I need my helmet to pry. Tavala armor to pry, I have that. Tavala helmet to pry. So hopefully with the stones that we have, we can do this. Repairing is also, you just exchange it for the gear that you want. Let's say the helmet. So I'm gonna just like one, two, three, four, five. So then you take your broken, this one, continuous, boom. You obviously, you can choose artisan memories and memory fragments, but Thank you. So now you use these stones for 100%. And I need to make a duo ring. So hopefully I can make a duo ring first try. If not, we're going to have to work for it, this. <laughs> so as you can see, I got the accomplishment for completion, but you cannot get it. As you can see, I cannot just accept this. So I need to do the rest first. Anyway, now I'm gonna go do the quest. Toodaloo. Till the quest, we meet. I just done did it. I just done did it. That was my last one. My last, my last one. So I just done did it. That was my last one. And now I get to complete. I'm just very happy. Yay! Now I need to complete Fetus, level up, use Bill of Face Scroll, and uh, yeah, we're good, dude. Miguel de uh, Mor Morton, thank you very much for leveling me. Uh, you got me to 60. With every single scroll, it, it took him one dude leveling uh, four people. It took him, or for me, it was 16 minutes from 57 to 58. Then 29 minutes from 58 to 59, and then 63 minutes from 59 to 60. On a path to a certain place, and then you like go make them coffee, and then you're like, ah, kind of like uh, I want to watch like a YouTube video, and then you completely like return back to BDO, and you're like, I remember what I forgot. <laughs> Yeah, so I went for Fetus. I deceived, de 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 defeated a thousand of them. Then I reached uh, level 60, use a pillow face scroll, and then Zarka, and then Karanda, I already done it. Tuva, I already done. Dad, done. I managed to hit a duo ring. I used like a 20, 20 or 30 stack to just make sure that I hit it without any. Um, um, so yeah, I got that as well. Reach 61. I think I'll do that tomorrow when I wake up. We're pretty much really, really close to being done. If uh, it wasn't for the Zarka. I would be probably now just chilling in the leveling AFK. But I had to miss a Zarka. <gasps> Cause I'm so smart. Cause I'm Zarka is in two hours and 38 minutes. Oh, uh, this is a, I didn't even know this existed. 
because I don't read patch notes. But for region 60, it gives me a pen to Valorant. Technically, it's a, like a, a duo, or do I need to specifically? I don't know, maybe. I wish I haven't done it and I wish I knew this so I could test it out, but yeah, I guess I have a pen. Uh, boom. 165 AP. Also, I kind of wanted to like make this into a one day, like basically do all the quests and all the requirements in one day. And I was thinking to myself, like, can you do this in one day? And I think you actually can if you're a little bit more talented than me, which is very simple to do so. All you need is a, a good tier 8 horse so you can travel across. It will help you a lot if you knew the quest before or like you do them like casually or especially the Valencia one. You do them like for the stacks and all that so you don't get confused or lost or anything. You got a, a good supply of coffee and uh, if you do get lucky with the Zarka and Karanda spawns as well but nothing else is like holding you back holding you back from uh doing it in one day maybe like reaching 61 but that's like with a good group if you have like a good guildy group or something you can do that up or if you have like that tome thing quest thing like the book thing where you uh basically you can level up to 61 pretty easily with just doing quests Oh right, we're here. So just need to summon it. So there we go. Achievement complete. So technically, I can just peace out and I'll be good. But GG. And it is the next next day. So this video is going on way too long. I need to wrap it up. Uh, Pillow face scroll. You saw that in the video. Boom. Defeat Zarka. I don't have footage of it because I after that Zarka, I immediately went to bed. Zarka, boom. Karanda, boom. Equip of Tavala helmet, boom. Armor, boom. Dual Tavala ring, boom. And now just need to reach 61. And we finally reached 61. I think you can do it easily in, in two days. Here it is, the otter emoji boom and we are here boys and girls yeah we completed everything uh, except the last one which is apparently this is where you need to do the 40 dailies you do the daily here boom and it's like hey dude wait what okay that's not the daily that i wanted wait what Wait, this... I guess I done it. Daily scroll. Oh, now you know, boys and girls. So now you know that the last one is actually you just complete the quest by talking to Fugar after you pretty much do all of them. And as you can see, I am definitely not a day 40 to complete all of this. I got a pickaxe, man. What the hell, man? No, thank you, man. Thank you. Oh, uh, to level 61, I did around 20 or 30 percent on training dummies while I was out yesterday. Then the rest of the levels, I just uh, did a quest. I will link a dude who was very or I saw his one of his videos and it definitely helped me. So I will link and give him a shout out in the in the description. Oh, yeah, 61. What do I get? High quality food box crowns, 50 stack. Damn. First style, classic box. Inventory slots, camera. Inventory slots, dog gear. Inventory slots. I took the one of the books because I was leveling. So a stack, courage, 50 mil, butler, more stones, more stones, arts and memories, storage butler, item scrolls, 60 crowns, Velcro stacks. Crown stacks, 80 stacks, and we are done for a try without a stack 30 40%. Uh, <sighs> no, thank you very much for watching. This was it. All of the other boxes and all the boxes I will open up on the hundredth of daily dose filming. So be sure to join up discord if you want to find out the date but don't worry i will announce it on youtube or in the next video or whenever so you don't miss out 
Roger. <gasps> this was me, the Valkyrie. Enjoy the rest of your day. <laughs>